Hi. So here we have to factorize 20x square minus 9xz minus 20z square. Right? So this particular expression is in descending order of powers of x and at the same time it is also in ascending order of powers of z. Right? So it is perfectly arranged. We need not to rearrange this expression. So what is the first step? First step is I'll multiply this 20 to this 20 and then find the factors in such a way that I get minus 9. So 20 multiplied by minus 20 is equal to minus 400. Right? This minus 400 tells us that one of the factors is negative. Right? So I'm going to write the factors of 20. So if I write the factors of this 20, they will be 5 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2, 5 to the 10 and 10 to the 20. And if I write the factors of this minus 20, they can be 5 multiplied by 2 multiplied by minus 2. Right? Yes. And this 5 multiplied by 5 gives us 25 and these 2 to the 4 and 2 to the 4 and this 4 will be negative. So these together will give us 4 for the 16 and this will be negative because this minus 2 is there. So we have minus 16. So the factors of 400 can be either 25 and minus 16 or they can be minus 25 and 16 right in both the cases we'll get minus 400 but I think this is the pair of factors which when added gives us minus 9 so we are going to use this pair of factors right so now let's rewrite this expression this can be written as 20x square minus 25xz plus 16xz minus 20z square. Right? Yes. And now what we do? We'll group them in two, two factors each. Right? And from these two factors, we can take 5 x common and inside the bracket we will have 4x minus 5z right and from these two factors we can take plus 4z common and again inside the bracket we will have 4x minus 5z right yes and now we have two terms from where we can take 4x minus 5z common and inside the bracket, we'll be left with this 5x plus 4z, right? Yes. So, these are the factors of 20x square minus 9xz minus 20z square. 